take an OSHA course and I promise we need this to protect ourselves while working. Why do you think non-slip shoes exist? Not because of fashion. Okay. So am I to understand that you believe that if OSHA hadn't came along, that people wouldn't have figured out that they need to wear non-slip shoes in slippery in environment work areas? Is that what I'm to understand? Or that people that need to wear hard hats might not have figured that out on their own. We only, we only are protected by OSHA, right? Okay, so then tell me this. Why hasn't OSHA shut, shut the science down? The universities, their science labs. You know, because it came out in hearings in the last few years that, that science has been doing gain of function for a long time, which is literally taking a virus and adding more deadly function to it to make it worse. So I wonder why OSHA doesn't do anything about that. That's seems like a pretty big deal, most especially after 2020 and COVID. And, and, and again, that's, that came out in hearings that that was gain of function. It was a manufactured virus. It was a, a virus that was amped up through gain of function. So where, where, where's OSHA? Where's OSHA shutting the, the university labs down and the science down and NIH? Oh, nowhere. Why? Oh, I wonder why. Well, because they're all, they're all in the same bed together, okay? Now, I, I know the 29 comments that I have people coming after me about OSHA, OSHA, OSHA. They're wonderful. They're okay. Sure, they are. Literally what they are is back in the day when the mob just ran the streets and everybody thinks, oh, the mob just disappeared. No, they didn't. They, went, they became the regulatory agencies. Because what did the mob do back in the day when they were working the streets? They would take money to shake the businesses down. And what, what did they say they were doing it for? Because they were going to keep you safe. The mob was keeping you safe. You got to give them that money, give them that handout so that they can make sure to give you a check mark that not to be touched and they were protecting your safety. Yeah. So the mob literally just became the regulatory agencies. They just put some suits on and, you know, we say it's all for safety and people in the public believe that bullshit. But it doesn't line up because the science and the university labs should have been shut down a long time ago then. Because they have, they have um, regulatory um, uh, things they have to follow too, but they don't. And OSHA doesn't do anything to them. Because OSHA protects the government, and the government is all about pro protecting the corporations. So OSHA, just like labor unions, is just a barrier that protects all of the wealthy, protects all of, and especially the Democrats. I mean, all these people that still love Bernie, I mean, please get a, get a clue for God's sake, okay? That the, the, the Democrats have always hated the Constitution. They have. They've always hated it. That's why they're always talking about wanting to change it and it needs to be evolved. Yeah, evolve into more regulatory agencies because who does that serve? It serves the Democrat Party, the Nancy Pelosi's, the corporations that are seen as human beings, by the way, because of poor um, uh, Supreme Court justices back in the day ruling that corporations are seen as many people in the system, so it's seen as a personhood. Yeah, that's part of the problem there too. But the fact is OSHA is just another corrupt organization because while we are supposed to trust them with safety, they've done nothing to shut the science down. I mean, look at all the people that died because of COVID. And th but that's not the only time they've done gain of uh, function research. It's the reason why we have scientists like Anthony Fauci. I, well, I, gotta, I even hate calling him a scientist because who knows if he even went to any science classes. Um, but literally said before 2020, like back in 2017, that Trump would, or 2016, Trump would experience a pandemic in his administration. Oh, interesting, Anthony Fauci. So you're, you're, you're like, a, yeah, uh, um, you can see into the future, huh? No, he knew because of doing gain of function. So if OSHA is so wonderful and you want to put them on a pedestal, then why haven't they shut science down? Well, they can't because they're all in the same corrupt criminal bed together. Okay? Because there is the science and the labs and the universities doing this kind of research should have been shut down a long time ago, and they haven't. 
So if you want to keep putting OSHA on some pedestal, then go ahead. But really what you want to worship is your um, babysitter socialism. But OSHA does not keep workers safe. Workers still get killed in this country and get hurt every day. OSHA has just made you believe that somehow um, without them, we would just be a society that couldn't figure anything out. Yeah, but if they were really a legit agency that wanted to protect the public or if public health was a legit agency that was about protecting the public, then you would think that they would have stopped the researchers in university labs that have been doing gain-of-function research for a long time because that's the most deadliest and dangerous thing you can do. But they've never done anything about that. So just goes to show you they're nothing but another corrupt criminal organization like all the other regulatory agencies.